Welcome to the Tuesday Two Minute Tutorials, where each week we look at a new judo and BJJ stand up skill in under two minutes. My name's Danny Williams, I'm one of the coaches at Camberley Judo Club. Okay, today we're going to look at a grip break and a grip break that is legal in the modern judo contest rules. Okay, so same side of the opponent, I'm right, so my partner. Here is playing the role of a right-hander there with their hand on the collar. We're going to look at how to get that sleeve under control. Okay, thumb on the outside. I want to grip as close to the bottom of the sleeve as possible. Up here, I have loads of purchase, but my partner can get their hand on. I want them. I want to break the grip so that my partner can't get their hand back on my kit. There, so thumb on the outside. Knuckle of the index finger up. Look, to tighten the kit onto the wrist here. Now, I always want to remember that wherever my partner's hand is on the kit, that is the central point of tension. Okay? Think of an elastic band here. I want to apply as much tension as possible so that I can snap it. That's the central point there. Okay, so other hand comes across, top of my hand, touching the bottom of my partner's hand, on the collar there. If it's lower, okay, it's too loose here, nice and tight. Pivot on the back foot to stretch our partner's arm out here, okay? Much harder to hold the dumbbell out there than it is here, okay? Same principle, so pivot here. When both feet are planted, okay, I'm gonna drive the hand on the sleeve down towards my opponent's foot, and I'm gonna rip my collar back in this direction. Not getting greedy, look, not getting greedy. I'll get back into stance before I put that hand on. Last important point, last important point, I make sure I switch stance before I try and rip off here, look. I lose power if I try and rip off when I'm there, okay? Nice analogy I like to use, okay? I can squat more with both feet on the floor than I can with one foot. So, one more time. There. Simple grip break for you. See you next week.